Hello everyone and welcome back to Fun Mythology. Now today's topic is how to construct an angle of 75 degree. The fastest way and the easiest way. So students, let's start. Follow this video and the lecture step by step and you will learn how to construct an angle of 75 degree in the fastest way. Okay, so in order to construct an angle, you need few instruments. As you know, you need a ruler, you need a protractor so that you can check whether uh, you have constructed the angle in a correct measurement or not you need a compass and a pencil okay so these are the three things that you need okay i am using a sketch pen instead of a pencil so that uh, you get a better visibility of the constructed angle okay how to start see uh, ordinarily and usually uh, in a construction of an angle you should start with an arm of the angle so i have already constructed the arm of an angle so unless and otherwise instructed, you just draw an arm of an angle. If you are been instructed to draw a line segment, so start with a line segment of a specific length. So in this case, I'm showing you by drawing an arm of an angle that is AO, O being the vertex of the angle. So take the compass, take any radius of your choice, okay, point the needle in the vertex O and draw an arc. Got it? So the, the arc will be intersecting AO at a certain point. Okay, point the needle there. Again, draw an arc intersecting the main arc. Okay, so what you are having here, if you, you know, join O and this intersection point, you will get 60. Got it? So let's join it. So let's join it. So point the intersection point correctly, take the point vertex O and join it. So this one will be what? So let us name it as B. So angle AOB is 60 degree. So let's check it out whether we have constructed it correctly or not. See, it's 60, right? So first of all, you need to draw or construct an angle of 60. Now, what do you need to do? without changing the radius of the compass i haven't changed it okay so what do you need to do draw or construct an angle of 90 degree from o so what do you need to do don't change it point the needle here in this first intersection point and draw another arc second arc okay now draw a 90 degree as usual okay draw this arc point the needle in the second intersection point and draw an intersection arc here okay now see point the intersection point properly now join o and this point what will you have you will have a 90 degree okay what will you have you will have a 90 degree got it so let's let's check it out let's check it out see now you have Now you have 90 degree, got it? So you have now 90 degree and you have a 60 degree. So let's let's mark them properly. So this is 90 and this is 60 degree, got it? So what is the left? See this one, what is the difference of 90 and 60? This is 30. So if I can bisect this angle 30, right? I'll get 15. So what happens? If I add 16 and 15, I get 75. So that is how we will be constructing an angle of 75 degree. So the last step will be to bisect this angle. Okay. So let's let's name this as C. So we'll be bisecting angle B O C. Okay. So let's bisect it. Okay. The very similar way. Okay. Take this point. Con you know, draw an arc here. Now take this point where 90 degree intersected the main arc, okay, and uh, see, this is the intersection point, okay, so mark the intersection point well, okay, point O and the intersection point, let's join it. So this, this is now, this is now 15 degree. As we have bisected 30, so we got 15. So 60 
plus 15 is 75. So let's name it as D. So angle A O D is 75 degree. Got it? So let's check it out. See with the protractor. Okay, place it properly. See. See between 70 to 80. See, this is 70 and this is 80, right? See, this is 70 and this is 80. In between, this is 75. So we have successfully constructed the angle of 75 degree with the ruler and compass. Okay. So I guess you have followed my lecture, student. I think it was easy. This is the fastest way and the easiest way of constructing an angle of 75 degree. Okay. So thanks for watching. Have a great day. We'll soon meet. Bye bye.